Grade 6 students at the VJ Primary School who are preparing to take the Caribbean Primary Exit Assessment Exams, CPEA, wanted to demonstrate their patriotism through a special 43rd Independence Observance of their own. This is in keeping with a school assignment for the standardized test. The COVID-19 pandemic squelched plans for their commemorative activities in 2021. This year, the students decided to go all out with an itinerary of events which also included a flag raising ceremony with the help of the police force. Some of the activities they organized included um, a walk that would be from, Deriso, from the school to Deriso and back. That will take place next Friday. We've had creative activities where the students created their own flags. Um, they did flags of chalk with chalk on the walkway of the school. We had an assembly. Our invited um, speaker was Ms. Raisa Joseph. She did a great job of that. And today's activity, we're going to be having the police officers from the community relations branch of the Buford Police Station. So they'll be here today to make a presentation on the national anthem and the national flag to our students. The police officers not only showed up, but personnel of the Special Services Unit also chipped in with the donation of a national flag and the company in pole, raising the symbol of St. Lucia nationhood aloft on the school grounds. The final part of the project that the students decided to do, they decided to um, seek a donation of a flagpole because we do not have one here at the school. And so CRB has decided to donate this flag flagpole and we are so very grateful to them for their assistance in that regard. So this is also another part of the project. The young students were grateful for the support of the men and women of the RSLPF in displaying the national pride. The grade 6 students of the VJ Primary School are grateful to the police officers of the Community Relations Branch of the Viewford Police Station for their donation of a flagpole to the school. They have helped us achieve one of our objectives for our project and we are very appreciative of their contribution. It will go a long way in helping us develop an attitude of national pride in the students of this school. Corporal Curly St. Jean of the Community Relations Branch of the Royal St. Lucia Police Force says the law enforcement officers jumped at the opportunity to assist the school as part of its mission of outreach. We decided to take it a step further in donating um, the poll and installing it as well. Uh, we collaborated with our colleagues at the Special Services Unit who are here with us today to carry out our plans. Yes, we also intend on um, using this opportunity to interact with the, the children. You know, we have a little activity planned to, um, and also some prizes we're hoping to, to get that done today. The commanding officer of the Southern Division of the RSLPF was also in attendance. They will be taught how to fold the flagpole. And so the community relations branch, we are continuing in our efforts to um, work together with the public. And so the school this morning will benefit from our presence. So this is just one of many projects that we'll be undertaking to ensure that we continue to build that good relationship with members of the public. The VJ Combined School was established in 2001. Joachim Duplessis, HDS News Force.